We start this episode of AI Storytime with the sentence I feel fantastic. Hey, hey, hey. What follows is a story written by AI. I feel fantastic. Hey, hey, hey. I'm sorry, Mr. Rumpus. There's probably nothing more frustrating than, isn't that what I thought I needed to know? That's not what we've come to realize. The people who know this, the people who knew this, the people who will never forgive you if you don't care about your health. You just don't give a damn. No. Even when you're dealing with things like I like having people around because I'm an overweight and I don't want them to be around me. The thing I need to understand is, don't worry. The good health of your body is not going to stop you from dying because of the bad health you deserve. I've known obesity for 23 years, and my body is in such good shape it's almost impossible to imagine why you wouldn't feel the same way if you were overweight, after all. But maybe you shouldn't be worrying. There's nothing wrong with giving too much of yourself over to yourself over a bad health. There's nothing wrong with turning away from the bad health you enjoy. This is the world we're created to live in. What are you going to do when you don't have health? If your body doesn't treat your junk problems, you're stuck in too much unnecessary activity which leads to depression. The world is full of junk food and addictive substances, and we really do need it. Don't worry, I'm not giving you excuses. I'm just giving you the facts here. This is the world we're creating in order because I'm going to tell you how to live with the bad health you enjoy. There's nothing wrong with letting go of unhealthy habits. There's nothing wrong with going off the food wagon because we all know what's going on. Oops. That was a good idea um. Oh. Sorry I'm so sick of that. There's nothing wrong with giving up our routine because we're starving and have to eat. Because our bodies are sick. The world's only purpose in life is to survive. To create a new world. A world for which our bodies fail to do anything about it. What is to be achieved when we don't have health? In this world, people need to stop eating junk food to eat. The best way to do them is to avoid junk food, because in the end, the only thing healthy and healthy is living to make it, to find the new normal. It's because we're addicted to junk food, and it's all the more ironic that it's going on right now in some form, in another form. I'm sorry, but I'm not going to complain. You get used to the fact that just because you're addicted to junk food, your body's going to fail. Because the body is addicted, and the body is addicted. The body is a prison for its own self. I mean, there you go. How does the person's body survive when they're addicted? The only thing is the weight. And they don't really look like that. The only thing is that the weight is a weight. It's a weight that happens. The only thing is the weight that happens to you really does not matter. I'm going to say this. A lot of people can't even think about how to live with this. But they don't even feel sick. They don't even think about the fact that their bodies have fat cells. They don't even realize the reason people are addicted to junk food, they just don't recognize it when it's actually happening to them because their bodies aren't as easy to understand. This happens in many ways even to obese people as well. But I'm going to give you the short answer. People have to take a certain amount of time to notice food, drink coffee, and other junk food, and to notice that they need to lose a portion of that too, when they can. Not only aren't these people addicted, are they addicted to the foods they consume? Absolutely. But is eating junk food just that bad for you? Do you think your body is eating junk food? Maybe you shouldn't. I don't know. Yeah, I think that's right. You need to be conscious of what's going on in your body, so that you can know that food exists when it's not getting enough, and that food can be really damaging. Because to be conscious is a huge responsibility of your body, especially to a healthy body, and not to eat junk food, but to get rid of it. To take an action that will make you take an action that will help you take an action that.